Hello everyone, this is Vignesh from Super Traveler and I'm here at the Grand Teton National Park. Um, I drove almost 15 hours from yesterday 1 p.m. till 6 a.m. in the morning. I reached early morning so I got a spot here at the Jenny Lake campground uh, for only one day and from tomorrow it's going to be closed so I'm going to find campground space in I think Gross Venture. Uh, which is a little bit further away. So I'm very excited. It's been raining quite heavily. Uh, just recently it got stopped, so I set up my tent there. And it's a beautiful campground, I think. Uh, um, I haven't fully explored yet, so I'll explore and also take some pictures and photos. This is Jenny Lake, which was formed 12,000 years ago on the foothills of Teton Mountains. Teton Mountains provokes a sense of timeless majesty. When I was there, I was captivated by how this lake shaped the beauty of Grand Teton National Park. I was breathing fresh air, experiencing pristine waters, majestic mountains, fall colors, and the roaring sounds of water touching the shores. I was so happy to be here to experience the solitude that these mountains and lakes offer. After spending time at the shores, I took a boat ride to the Hidden Falls. The boat ride gives a unique perspective of Teton Mountains from the middle of the lake. And I recommend anyone visiting Cheney Lake to take this boat ride to experience the mountain in a totally different way. And when I reached the dock, I took the trail to the beautiful Hidden Falls. I could hear the sounds of nearby river roaring through the valley. The fall colors accentuated the beauty of these waterfalls. Finally, I reached the Hidden Falls and it was truly hidden from the plain sight until you came 100 feet from the falls. After taking in the falls, I headed back to the ferry, which was the last one, to the visitor center. There were others who took the trail to the inspiration point where they could experience 
the whole lake from a 400 feet viewpoint whereas I travel back to the visitor center in order to get back to my campground so that I could rest after a long drive that I took to Grand Teton National Park. I had this mountain one last time on the boat before heading back to the campground. I hope you enjoyed this and I'm going to upload part 2 of Grand Teton National Park in few days. If you like it, just comment and I will get back to your awesome comments. Thank you so much for watching.